coming up on PE this week, firefighters battle two separate fires in the blazing heat and it has been nearly nine years. But finally, the trial for Ricky Lee Fowler, the man charged with starting the old fire, which burned more than 1,000 homes and killed five people, is underway. And triple-digit temperatures sweep across the Inland Empire. PE This Week starts now. Hello, I'm Jackie West, and welcome to another edition of PE This Week where we look at news where you live. As the temperatures rose to over 100 degrees this week, two separate fires erupted in the Inland Empire. The first fire broke out Monday in San Bernardino County off Highway 18 near Old Waterman Canyon Road. The U.S. Forest Service says the blaze burned through 75 acres and four firefighters were injured. The cause of the blaze is still under investigation. Another wildfire that broke out Wednesday morning blackened 45 acres in a canyon south of Banning in the Twin Pines area. One firefighter was taken to the hospital with heat exhaustion, this according to Cal Fire. The cause of the blaze is unknown. It has been nearly nine years since the old fire, which claimed the lives of five people and burned more than 1,000 homes. And on Monday, the trial for Ricky Lee Fowler finally began. The San Bernardino resident is charged with starting the blaze and with five first-degree murders from heart attack deaths that authorities said were caused by the stress of dealing with the fire. The old fire was set in the San Bernardino Mountains along Old Waterman Canyon Road near Highway 18. It charred 91,000 acres. If convicted as charged, Fowler could face the death penalty. Temperatures swept through the Inland Empire this week, and with those high temperatures comes heat advisories and fire danger. Health officials have some tips, and reporter John Asbury shares some of those with us. Authorities are telling people to stay indoors when possible and go to county operated cool centers to avoid being outdoors in the heat. Now, in addition to the heat, fire danger is at an extreme high, and fire crews are working in a large capacity to swarm the small fires to keep them from getting out of control. So if you can, I would just relax in a pool all day. Well, that wraps up PE this week. I'm Jackie West. I'll see you next Thursday.